Hello, Hello everybody. everybody, my name is Amy Stevens, and welcome back to Roosty. Now, <clears throat> in this episode, I'm going to start preparing ahead of time for the next double experience weekend. Um, and my goals right now are, one of them is already completed, which is Christmas 90 Fletcher, which I achieved, I think last week, is already at 91, but the other ones are... 90 crafting, which I think I will get from the protein hides, which give a lot of experience. Uh, my other goals are 95 dungeoneering, which I don't really need to prepare for. So in fact, that's just dungeoneering. 91 thieving. I'm already at 89. I've been doing some preparedness thieving to help me get up there. Uh, 90 magic, which you can probably easily get. And 92 prayer. Right now I'm at 86 prayer, so I need to do a lot of preparing uh, when it comes to the prayer. Now, how many bones do I have? None. I only have one bone, big bones, or bones, arrow, cross dragon, dragon, iron dragon, green or dragon. Or I can just do the thing in preparedness, which is the planting stone. Um, I might get 91 thieving before the next double experience weekend, so I might not have to worry about that at all. But it's always handy when it comes to having dummies. Thieving, training dummy, melee, agility, magic, slayer, hunting. Breath of range training dummy. Oh, he's upstairs. Uh... <laughs> I also want to try to get any herb lord, but I'll need a lot of plants to get to that. <clears throat> um, and bench, I can probably get up to 70 easily on um, the next couple of experience we can do that with 1,000 protein. Holy shit, I have 1,021 protein cogs. And the 90 divination should be a snap since I have 301 protein memories. Um, I do want to try to get. Alright, let's see. When can I start making uh, corrupted stuff? Or getting one of those corrupted things? 87. Uh, corrupted ore. 89. So I need two more smithing levels to be able to start doing the corrupted ore. And. Oh, good God. I'm going to be from the white hole. I'll be right back. I am back. So, what should I do first? Should I do the why did I close the notepad? Okay, I can probably get 90 crafting beforehand. Concerning the fact that I'm only 260,000 away from that, I can just do the Citadel for that. And if I'm dungeonary, I'm three levels away from that. 91 Thieving, two levels. 90 Magic, three levels. And 92 Prayer, six levels. Shit, there's gonna be a lot of Prayer work. So I should probably start stocking up on bones, uh, like dragon bones and stuff like that beforehand. That way I can just be prepared for, you know. And also, I'm gonna. Go up and spend. I'm gonna go buy a couple of cleansing crystals from up here. Here's the tra chapel, whatever the fuck you want to call it. Heffen. Okay. Myler and Kadaran. Ooh, I can I could go pickpocket some Kadaran um workers. 
Não sei onde perto ele tem o... A pessoa lurker. With the scroll. Yes, I'm sure you did. Alright, so what I'm going to do right now is I'm not actually prepared for anything anything for the Lens series again since I can just use screening pistols with the Fortis Serum Stone with prayer. Four prayer during the next of the series again. So what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to do a little bit of theming and fitness or some bossing. Or I can do my Slayer task, which is 38 Mithril Dragons. Those bastards are brutal. Alright. Okay, just don't have to go. Jesus Christ. I'm going to. Um. Alright, she's. I just want to check my kingdom first before I do anything else. So let's just go to Miscellaneous. Last selected two weeks ago. Okay, let's get. I'm gonna wait until it says last last selected four weeks ago. That way, I can collect the maximum resources possible. If, it's, if my blue lead is at like 50%, 40%, whatever. Alright, so we're going back to. Wait, did I do my um, troll invasion for this month? I do not think I did. Let me check the. Thing. Can you fucking not, Princess? Me game combat. Uh, shit. All. Troll invasion. I did not get the reward for this month, I don't think. But first I have to stock up on food, just in case, although it's not really required to bring food into troll invasion, but it's always helpful. Right, if I did not collect the reward, then we'll do troll invasion today. Start fighting. So to do the troll invasion, all you gotta do is kill all these trolls, basically. And also, there's a supply tub here that you can drink from, which, you, which will re rejuvenate your adrenaline, your summoning points, and your life points. Also, avoid going past that torch, because the thrower trolls have a good defense setup that way. Oh, really, Claymore? But my friend changed his name from Mr. Claymore to Captain Winky. And kill the poorly cooked Caramboard as soon as you can. Because those guys usually like to go into these. And you see, <coughs> the trolls have a great defense at, the pa at this passage with rock throwers. Also, you directly can get information on these uh, scale of and range attacks. An, an example, throws rock at his target, also might throw a huge boulder into the air, which crashes down shortly after. But if you think that's all you gotta deal with, you're wrong. Because there's a wizard right there. And the wizard will pull you to him. Or summon a bunch of vines that go under your feet and damage you periodically. 
129,095 for 10. Of course, my minister pays 130,297 um, constitution. The troll father. Oh crap, I should. I cannot be able to. So I'm going to go all the way out here. And see? See all those vines? That's the doing of the wizards. But it's always smart to kill the poorly cooked Karen Bond the minute you see in the spawn. Now. The troll runs. Where's the troll father? Oh. I forgot. He's dead. Uh, pardon me? You can bring any type of food you want, but for me, I usually bring rock tails, but since I want to stock up on my rock tails and keep them for boss fights, I'm using, I'm using great white sharks right now. Troll father again. Oh, gotta kill them. Going to the Karambon. And this Karambon. There we go. Hey, don't be pulling me towards you, dick. My stats are down by two, but that's okay. My combat stats. Not my health, which is weird. Alright, Troll General, what the hell is on my life? Dynamite, 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 dynamite. If you want to keep your supply table, go right after the dynamite. Because if he gets there, in time, They'll destroy the supply table. Also, there are two modes for this. Easy mode and hard mode. Right now I'm on hard mode. Because that's where the rewards really are. There's only 7 waves on hard mode. But 20 waves on easy. I've never done easy mode. I've only done hard mode. Due to the fact that I'm pretty much a badass at this. Why the fuck that? Oh. Spirit Scorpion. Also, there's, a, there's also a summoner. Which will summon a Spirit Scorpion or a Bunyip. I guess there was two summoners. <clears throat> Alright, watch my fire right here. Attack the dynamite, attack the dynamite, attack the dynamite! Oh yeah, kill the poor little Tenem one. Jesus, wizard. Alright, kill the wizard. Alright, let's kill the mountain troll next, and then we'll start killing the troll runs. Actually, we'll kill the troll father first. I guess. Then we'll kill the troll runs. And now we'll attack the. And now we wait for me to win. And that is how you handle troll invasion like a boss. I think the mass level for the troll invasion is 49. So if you have gear, that's like. Let's see. Depends. So if you have, let's see. What's the? So if you have rune armor, mystic armor, anything above level fifty armor and weaponry. And you're fine. If you don't, and you're in combat, uh, um, 27, you're pretty much fine. But now that, I, but now I have a reward book, and with this reward book, 
I can get a lot of experience. So what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to put that, put that experience towards thieving. Since I only really care about thieving right now. Actually, yeah, thieving is. I got 62,000 experience for thieving. And by the way, when you do thieving in preparedness, you get... It, it automatically thieves for you. You don't have to do anything. Alright, and I'll show you what I mean right now. Let's take out 13 of these, and 3 of those, and 1 pound. One more pound. Alright, so let's head back to preparedness. And we'll do some preparedness thieving. We'll start in... I don't work. Then we'll go to um I forgot what the district to the south to uh west of here was. I think it was Let's see, there's my there's Myler, Kadarn, Treyern, um, Iowerth, Heffin, Kadarn. Did I say Kadarn? I don't know. Lady Trey. So this so that's the Treyern district. This is the I'm in the Iowerth district. Um, to the northeast is the Kadarn district. To the north of the great of preparedness Grand Exchange is the Heffern District. So up here is either something or something. <laughs> Cast Abyssal Stell. In fact, I'm not even gonna push anything. It automatically thieves for you. Although you do have a chance to get a bunch of um, potions, noted potions at one. Or one dose. <clears throat> you know, I've made, I've probably made about two hundred thousand just by thieving from these guys. Two hundred thousand coins. But you have to be careful because if you thieve and they catch you once, that's one strike. Catch you twice, two strikes. But if you get to a third time, then you cannot pickpocket from that district. For 20 minutes. See, you have raised clan Iowa suspicions. One out of three strikes. What are you doing? Clan Iowa has started to notice your sneaky ways. Two out of three strikes. They'll catch you next time. No, they won't. I'm a god. See? They got it getting caught. Oh dear. They've caught you and they've warned the rest of Clan Iowers. Which means the Iowers clan has warned, been warned about you. You'll have to wait 20 minutes before you can pick up with them again. So what we're going to do now is we're going to head up to... Ethel, Ethel, that was it. Ethel was the last district. So I'm going to head up to Ethel and start theming from them. But, but you probably won't get much. This word. How the hell could I forget about the Ethel district? I don't know if my friend might be watching this, but I just wanted to say, call for what? That is all. Anyway, the Abyssal Lurker 
is a level I don't know what level it is, but <clears throat> there's one strike for Ithel suspicions. For Fanish Thievian is actually really helpful if you want to level up quickly. What are you doing? Um Nothing. First one, two, strikes so far. Ooh! I got a, I got a sealed elite cruise girl. Awesome! There it is! Now I cannot feed from Ithel right now. So what I'm going to do right now is, is I'm going to store everything that I've thieved so far, including my elite. <clears throat> we'll eat the shark, deposit the soda ash, which should be in my loot tab, deposit U4, deposit U6, deposit U, and then you. Okay, so now we're going to head over to Kadarn, which is to the east. My little Kadarn, Ithel, Iowa, Heffin. Myler, Kadarn, Heffin, Treyern, Ithel, Iowa. Six districts in Perfinus. Might be more, actually, I'm not too sure. I'll have to check the map once I get over to the location that I want to get to. I'm uh, about to lose my TV boost. So, we are just about to enter the Kadarian district. Krillis! There's Krillis, there's Krillis too! How many fucking districts are in this place? Let's check. Okay, so we got Phyllis, Myler, Heffin, Amlod. Amlod as well. It's L, Iowerth, Treyer, and Good Air. How the hell can I forget about how the hell can I forget about Amlod? Amlod is this district where I got 99 summoning. The last just double experience we get. Okay, so let's activate or let's task the official stealth, and then we'll start pickpocketing from these guys. What? I just freaking <clears throat> You don't really get much in these guys, but you did get a it's a damn good experience. Priest, I think I think I'll be trying to go for 90 thieving tonight. That's one out of three strikes. Okay, let's start thieving from this one. Unpowered orbs. Are those worth anything? 210. That's not too bad if you thieve a lot. Okay, that's two strikes. Let's put up a disc of damn worker. Encoding overload. It's considered turning down video settings for using a faster encoding. Ah, papi, you don't pali, papi, the. Ah, damn it. Okay, so. I'm gonna go through this real quick. Pickpocket, oh, next level I can pickpocket dwarf traders. And then at 91 I can do Iowa workers, then Ithel, then Rogue Tapton, then Kadarin, then Amlod. Oh, I really want to start pickpocketing Amlod workers. 
So once I hit 90 DB, I'll be able to start pickpocketing from analog rookies and get a bunch of summoning supplies. Oh, for fuck's sake. Hold on, guys. <clears throat> I do not like being disturbed when I'm recording for YouTube! Alright, so let's just throw everything from my bag in the bed. A crystal mother load shard. Okay, you can exchange these shards for rewards from the mother load mob by speaking to Withian in the Myler district. Or for fitness. Okay, where is Myler? Myler is in the, is the farming district. I know I was getting so much experience from the Kudaren working so the voice of Saren is active in the Kudaren district. The voice of Saren illuminates a different district every hour. Okay, so who am I looking for? The bitch named Ma? That's Coden. Um... Speaking to Lithium. The screw was held. Dr. Lord was. Hello. Um. Wood cutting and farming. The previous district is focused on wood cutting and farming. Okay. Get the fuck out of here. Damn, this will look Yeah. Okay, so where the hell do I... Where the fuck is Mother of Ma? Wait, is this is Mother of Ma in here? Probably not. That is... That build. What the hell is it? That's the spirit tree. Um... That's war on. Afternoon. Where the hell is Mother Lord Ma? Shut up. Uh. We'll try talking to war on. Yeah, fuck yeah. Oh, this is Krillis. I'm in the wrong district. Myler. Is Myler up here? Oh yeah, I know where it is. I know where to go now. I just had a massive brain fart for a minute there. Wait, I'm going to talk to this woman first. What can I do though? Ninety ranged, ninety two, ninety agility, eighty two, and ninety strength, ninety nine. <clears throat> then, the ma is a lithium right here. There we go. So Myler, so this is the Myler district. <clears throat> Ten mother loads charged for one item. I'm interested. Yes. Fuck you. Do I have any more um mother load charge? Let's check for a bank. <clears throat> That's the only one I have. Right now I'm in the... 
I'm still in the Milo district. So let's let's look at the summoning guide real quick. I want to, I want to try and figure out what level the abyssal lord can be made at. I think it's like eighty something like that. Uh, let's see. So far, we're at 60. No sign of the thing yet. Abyssal Lurker, here it is, 62. Green Charm, Abyssal Charm, and 118 Shards. <clears throat> it's, easier, it's easier to just buy it. Buy, it. buy the pouches and the scrolls. So, just saying. So, that's the Heaven District up there. This is the Grand Exchange. But it looks like I have to hold this episode in a moment because well it's already 141. So I'm gonna start finishing up this episode here. Um, we got a lot done today. So yeah. Uh, actually, let's. Pick out all of these. And we'll go over to this person right here to decant all of the things. Watch my inventory. Watch this part right here. I got a bunch of vials. We're gonna drink the super strength and we're drink the super magic. I'm going to drink the Super Defense. I'm going to drink the Super Region. And then everything else can just go right into my bed. I'm going to decant. Um, I'm going to save those potions and decant them with these. I'm going to wind up my birthday and then I'm going to finish and then I'm going to stop the episode. Alright then, that's done. But I guess you know what, I guess you know what this means. That means that I'm all out of time for this episode. I'm going to leave it at that. So thank you everybody so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this and let me know what you think in the comments below. What do you think about this episode of RuneScape? Did you, learn, did you guys learn a lot more today? About thieving? Did you? DID YOU?! That was fun, I enjoyed that. Um, I, I think I'm definitely going to get all my, most of my goals next week. Um, in uh, the next couple of screens weekend, I'm definitely going to get most of my goals because of the preparedness of thieving, and then the crafting, and then the magic. I actually do want to try to get 90 herb lore as well. So I might. So I'm gonna just. You know. Die. Right. <laughs> anyway, once again, thank you all for watching. You know, that is not fun for RuneScape! And you want to see me. And you want to see RuneScape in my live stream next week. Give that like button a high five, and I'll see you guys. If I do a live stream next week. In the next video. Bye!